your comment of the day goes to. Thank you for the nice comment and if you want to get comment of the day, just comment down below anything nice in the comments. Hey lovely squad, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can see by the title of today's video, I'll be talking about some drama that went on in the Adopt Me community. But before I even tell you guys all the tea that you guys need to know, please make sure to like and subscribe. I'm really trying to hit 300 subscribers, um, not before my birthday because I think that's too big for my liking but i mean we can make it happen but if not i'm hoping to get it like somewhere around march but anyway so like you guys can let's just get into the video so i don't know if you guys are aware of what happened like yesterday but i record this yesterday but i don't know if we out on the day i'm recording this but anyways so adami and this person called it's c crafter i'll leave their like twitter up on the screen they recently had a bit of drama well i wouldn't say drama but something happened between them and guess what adopt me blocked them and you might be like why would adopt me block them well here's why so i'm pretty sure you guys have pretty much seen youtubers like a lot of youtubers have videos like you know when an update's gonna come and like want to see what the pets look like they're easily able to leak it and it's because of itsy crafter itsy crafter somehow is able to find all of the latest pets that are coming in to adopt me and he shares them on his twitter that's how before the ladybug update even came out many youtubers knew what the update like from now was going to look like which was pretty pretty crazy so what, you, what i'm trying to prove is is that itsy crafter pretty much is able to like like show updates before they're even out and basically adopt that's the thing that's um like caused this problem that's how adopt me is like not becoming happy because of this so basically adopt me is like they worked hard on the pet they've done this they've done that it's took them a long time for somebody just to like leak it you guys know what i mean like it's like all that hard work was just nothing because like if you're gonna leak it and like what's the whole point of getting excited for the update you know what i mean but i'll just put the tweet on the screen of basically like what they're saying and everything and i'll be with you guys watch you guys read the tweets So guys, now that you've read the cheats, I'm pretty sure you guys get the gist of what I'm talking about because I mean, yes, the Adopt Me team do work very hard to give us updates frequently and like, yes, let's just give them a round of applause for like giving us such amazing updates. <laughs> That's all I have for you guys today. I just want to know your opinion on Adopt Me blocking them. In my opinion, let's just say I don't think they needed to block him. I think Fitcher just personally went on and DM'd him, going through to say that please can you not leak any more of the updates. I'm not trying to see if Adopt Me stopped being respectful, but if I like owned Adopt Me, I would have done that. And I must imagine how devastating and surprised the person's feeling out into a picture of proof that adopt me blocked him or them or whoever they are but anyways as i said that's all i have for you guys today let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this your opinions your thoughts do you think it's the right idea for adopt me blocked it c crafter but anyways i love you guys so so much and i'll guys i'll and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys